Well, hello, 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 y'all. Welcome to Vlogmas 10. Jeez. What is going on? It's going by so fast. I can't, I don't know. Uh, sometimes it feels like December and sometimes it doesn't. Um, I hope y'all are doing well. So, picking up, you know, picking up with the last vlog left off. It's a few hours later. So, <laughs> I don't know, I'm not like extremely hungry, but for some reason I wanna to go to Panda Express. Um, I wish Panda Express was closer to my house. On second thought, that may be a bad thing. If it was close to my house, I'd probably be going over there way too much. So I guess it's good that it's kind of far away. Um, it's over here, there's the two, two that I know of in my city and they're on opposite ends of the city and I'm in the middle. So yeah, so gonna pick me up some Panda Express. We have Penelope's choir concert uh, tonight, which I'm super excited about. Um, I know y'all heard me talk about this stuff before, but I love going to the kids' events at school. Um, I'm just so proud. I hope I don't cry. Um, I just, you know, they're only little once, and she's almost 13 in a couple of weeks, and you know, we she, we we went out to pick at Walmart last night to pick out that. Christmas sweater and she got so I didn't show this she also got some Mickey Mouse um, earrings um, to go with it and it's just so cute and she was even gonna get a headband with like reindeer I would wear that too but I mean I know past a certain age some kids don't wear stuff like that but I was like so happy inside when she said she still wanted to wear like reindeer you know like a little headband like that because it just made me feel like oh she's still she's still kind of little but we didn't see any of those at the walmart we went to last night so we didn't get the headband but anyway they just grow up she's um i just love going to and my dad's coming too we haven't seen my dad in a couple of weeks i think we saw him a, the day before thanksgiving so i'm glad excited to see my dad um catch up with him and maybe he will be later in this vlog and uh, maybe we'll eat after we go to the choir concert because the concert starts at 6 30 and what else i've got a headache the concert starts at 6 30 no it's on this side mm. and then it'll probably get out by like 7 45 or 8 and then by the eight o'clock is usually my girl's bedtime so there's no time for me to cook food tonight. So I'll probably pick food up somewhere. And yeah, that is what's going on. Hi, can I get a two one tray with um, double orange chicken with half rice, half noodles? Okay, play half and half, double orange, what else today? And a medium Coke, and that's it. All right, good, well, four, thank you. Thank you. Okay, so I'm parked at McDonald's. I just went through the drive-thru. Ah, Panda. Oh my gosh. Double orange chicken, half rice, half noodles. But they gave me a spoon, they didn't give me a fork. Oh well. I did get two fortune cookies though. Cool. Okay, so I'm um, I'm at parked at Abigail School. She sh she should be getting out of school in a few minutes. So I pretty much got two for one because they're like stuck together. I'm gonna see what my fortune cookie says. This one's crumbled. Do y'all let me know? Do y'all just read the fortune cookie, or do you eat the fortune cookie too? I do both. Wait. Read my fortune cookie. Ah, let's read. You are the life of the party. That is true. Sometimes I am the life of the party. And sometimes I'm not. Sometimes somebody else is. 
one. Let's read this one. Any troubles you have will pass shortly. Wow, well, that's really nice. Okay, good fortune. Good fortunes. And we can use the numbers. Oh, there's no numbers on this one. And there's no numbers on this one. I was going to say we could use the numbers for a lottery ticket, but I don't really play the lottery that much. My husband likes to do the scratch-offs. I think that's what I'm getting him for Christmas. Hopefully he doesn't watch this video. Maybe I'll have to put this part out. Because every day Amazon is coming to him for something. So he, he always, we, he, we always say Christmas comes every day for him. But maybe I can get him some scratch-offs from the convenience store. I'm a nice wife, right? Okay, so school is out now, and Abigail got something to tell you. Oh, I got a sticker. Can you show everybody a sticker? I got something for you to eat that you can have that's left over that I ate. Guess what it is? What? Panda Express? Yeah. Okay. It's just a little bit left. Do you want it? Sure. What's that? It says, it says you gotta show Drama it. Llama. Drama Llama? What is that? It, it, it's a tattoo you can put on your comb book anyway. Oh, that was nice. So the teacher gave it to you? No, uh, you have to. I spent two quarters on that. Oh, the money, then, I, yeah. the money I gave you? Yeah, and then two quarters on lunch. Oh. The girl's eating the last. Is it the last bite? Oh, ch oh. I was going to say a Chinese kitchen. <laughs> it's Panda Express. Mm -hmm. I left a little bit for her. Yeah. Is that good? I already ate it. <laughs> yeah. Kids are always star starving when they get out of school. I, re I remember when I got used to get out of school, I would go home and watch Saved by the Bell and eat ice cream and cereal. I, I know I've said that before, but that's what I used to do. I think I spy the cookie man. <laughs> You're wearing your new shirt. Yeah. Yay. How long have you been here? Oh, about 10 minutes. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, oh, are y'all being tickling each other? Yeah. You want to say hi, Dad? Hi, Dad. No, say hi to the vlog. Oh, hi to the vlog. <laughs> you want to say hi? Hi. So the choir performance is about to start. Super excited, aren't we? We sure are. Welcome. Thank you so much for coming. If you need a program, there are some QR codes right here, and you can come down. You're free to come down and come get them. And I think there's some at the back if you want to go back there. Um, I'm so glad y'all came tonight. We're going to hear some wonderful music. We're going to start with Kim. Everybody, we are at Taco Villa eating tacos. Penelope's hiding. There's Abigail. You want to say hi? What are you having? Oh, I'm in soft chicken. Soft chicken tacos. <laughs> I'm having a burrito. It's pretty messy. Hey everyone, I'm back. We are back from Penelope's choir performance. 
Um, so I forgot about my laundry I had in here, so I've got to get my laundry out. So I thought while I'm getting my clothes out of the dryer, I would give y'all an update. So we, I had a little bit of a scare on the way to Penelope school. So the school she goes to is really far. It's on the other side of town. It's far. And so I dropped off my husband at work early so we could go to her performance. And so y'all know I've had problems with my car before. Um, I talked about it on another vlog. Well, I just put oil in my car the other day. Now, I'm no professional about cars, but my oil light, when I dropped off my husband, it started blinking. And I just put oil in it. So I know there, I'm, I'm scared that there's another oil leak. I just paid $700 like two months ago to get an oil leak fixed. So I've been, you know, this is an old car. It's a 2005 minivan. Um, it's pretty old. I got it like two years ago. I actually bought it from this lady on Facebook. Um, but I do have some money saved. And I knew, I'm, I, I know that I was going to be needing to get a new car in January. Or I was thinking January or February. But it looks like I might be car shopping this weekend. And, you know, I wasn't, I'm already, um, but it looks like the car thing can't wait any long. I'm really need a new car because I can't just keep repairing, <coughs> repairing my minivan. It's just, it's about to die on me. Okay, hold on. My, belt, my dog, my dog needs to be, I need to feed my dog. <laughs> so anyway, um, on my way to, um, on my way to get my, uh, to take my daughter to the choir concert, which was on, it was out way over there. Um, my, the oil light kept flashing. Every time I'd stop at a stoplight, it would flash. And so I'm here freaking out. I'm like, oh God, please let my car make it to walk to her choir performance. Please, dear God. It made it to the choir performance. And then I kind of couldn't enjoy her choir performance because I was worried about my car. Like, will I be able to make it home? Thankfully, we made it home. We're here. But tomorrow, I'm taking it to the oil shop. And hopefully, they don't tell me there's oil leaks. If there is, I'm definitely going to get a car a new car this weekend so wish me luck because i'm going car shopping much sooner than i had anticipated tiffany may be getting a car for christmas <laughs> oh the family not just tiffany the family because it we have only have one vehicle my husband doesn't drive he's from brazil and he just didn't drive over there he kind of where he lived he could walk everywhere and there was better transportation so he doesn't he doesn't drive he's planning to eventually drive but he doesn't drive now um, so it's really, and you know, I'm the taxi driver. I have to take the kids to school to take my husband to work, you know, and I need a car. I just need a car. It's a must. So please wish us luck with that. I may be taking y'all around to car shops this weekend. We will see. And I may not be stuck with a minivan. I may be, I may not, I mean, I like minivans cause you can fit a lot in there, but I don't know. What is a good type of car I should get? Let me know. Hey everybody, what is up? So I am on my way to the oil place to get my oil checked and I don't want to go. I hate going to these places, especially by myself, but I have to do what I have to do to get it checked out and then maybe I can enjoy the rest of my day. So. I will check back with y'all later. Hey everybody. I've just been stopped. I stopped in the Walmart parking lot because it was close to the oil place. And I just got off the phone with my sister. I was with my sister. I was on the phone with my sister for an hour. When we talk, we talk. We talk a lot. We have a lot of stuff to catch up on. So um, yeah, we talk a lot. <laughs> Um, but it was really good because I, I just, like, she understands me. She's really understanding. She's not critical. She's just, she's my, she's my best friend, you know. Um, anyway, I got good news when I left the oil place. There's not an oil leak in my car. Um, my oil was actually fine. Um, 
it's just a sensory issue because my my car's old like the oil there wasn't even a problem last night it was just the sensory in my car is off so that's why the oil light <coughs> went on um but that doesn't mean i can st not look i still need to start looking for a car i need to start the process of looking for a car um so yeah that's what's going on and by the way it is so nice it is so nice to meet nice people uh, this guy that changed my oil. I mean, just someone having like a nice conversation with you. Like not being critical of you. Not telling you bad news about your car. Which, I mean, that's not his fault if he tells me bad news about a car. But it's just like my morning went better than I thought it would. Because I, I was, honestly, I was about to start crying. Um, because I'm stressed out about car stuff. And I'm stressed. There's a million things to do and not enough time to do them. If you know what I mean. Um, but I, I just feel like having a good conversation with people, like I had a good conversation with my sister and then this guy at the oil place, we were talking about like banks. I don't know how we started talking about banks. We were talking about banks and, and I just, I didn't feel like the dumb girl who doesn't know anything about cars. I, I didn't, they didn't make me feel that way. Like sometimes you go into these car shops or these car places and you honestly feel, or I personally, I feel like a dummy. You know, like, I'm just this poor little girl. But I didn't feel that way this time. I felt like this guy made me feel good. Which is like, it made me, it made me feel like good. So I think my day is going to do a turnaround. You know, I'm trying to just turn it all around. Hope for the best. And, yeah. So, okay, so it is now 11 o'clock. I told you I talked to my sister for an hour. Um, I haven't had breakfast. I think, um... So, actually, this new dentist that I'm seeing, um, he gave me, um, he, oh, my sister's texting me. <laughs> we're, we're, we're trading pictures because I told her that my new dentist is good looking. And I was going to send her a picture of my dentist. And she told me that she just saw a chiropractor yesterday and he's kind of good looking too. And so, we're going to compare her chiropractor to my dentist. We're just... We're just being funny. We're both happily we're both happily married. Um, we're just being funny here. But um, I was like, it is nice to get, you know, it doesn't hurt to have a good looking dentist or chiropractor working on you. You know what I mean? Um, so um, anyway, so anyway, talking about going to talk about my dentist again. Uh, my new dentist. They gave me a gift that I showed in my other video: a coffee mug full of floss, a new toothbrush. And y'all, they gave me a Starbucks card, which I was shot a Starbucks gift card for five bucks. I know Starbucks is expensive, but I think five bucks would maybe pay for a coffee. Um, I used to go to Starbucks all the time when I worked in the mall. And when I worked at the Chinese restaurant, I would go to Starbucks before it opened up before I went to work. Oh, I don't want to honk at this guy, but he's not going. Um, so i'm gonna treat myself to a starbucks coffee well they're treating me the gift card is and then i think i'm gonna get a bagel and then i need to go pick up my husband from work so that's how my morning's going i hope y'all are doing well it's a very windy day here in lubbock texas very windy okay guys i don't know if you can tell how brown the sky is it's very like the sky is brown today. <sighs> okay, so I just uh, got done with Starbucks. I got a whole wheat bagel with cream cheese. And I tried a new drink. I got the um, peppermint latte. A peppermint latte. It was pretty good. I'm not sure if it's something I would get all the time. Well, I guess it's just for Christmas, the peppermint. But yeah, it was good. I'm going to end this video here because it's, uh, I think it's about 20 minutes now. And I'm sorry if the vlog, the, a lot of this vlog was me driving and talking. So I hope you don't mind that. It just, it turned out to be, sometimes you think your vlog is going to go one way. I wanted it to more be more of a fun thing where we go to the mall together and get coffee. But it turned out to be more about car problem, car stuff. So anyway, that's just life. But thank you for being here. And I will see y'all in the next Vlogmas video. Bye, guys.